Yo guys, how you doing? Tommy Roney here, bringing you another video on how to complete an S well, an SBC, an objective really quickly, guys. We were going to go over the SBCs, but I think the icons are overpriced. Like the video if you think so as well. I mean, that's an incredible icon, but it's way too overpriced. Um, and it's not worth it in comparison to the prime or mid uh, icon player pick, guys. But let's get straight into this Ruben Neves. How do you complete? Make sure to subscribe if you obviously enjoy this kind of content. Let's get us to 1.1k subs. If we're there already, make sure to get us to 1.2k. You guys are amazing. Uh, win 15 matches using only Premier League players in the start in 11 in managerial masterpiece. Score 30 goals using Premier League players. Assist 20 goals using Premier League players. Assist from a cross using Premier League players in four separate matches. And score a finesse goal in six separate matches. So the quickest you can do this is 15 matches. And um, golden goal would usually be very helpful. But EA tries to screw us over here. Score 30 goals, which means you need to score two goals in a match. So if you can, make sure to help someone out by allowing them to score two goals. And then quitting. I think that's the best way to do it. First one to two wins it. Um, assist 20 goals will happen naturally as you score 30 goals. I think it can be done in 15 matches if you obviously win all of them in a row so uh, using Premier League players that's pretty easy you know you can use any Premier League player so I think that's, that makes it very very easy obviously rating 77 max but um, because manager or masterpiece which is goddamn hell but you know that's the best way to do it and then assist from across using Premier League players in four separate matches and score a finesse goal using Premier League players in six separate matches um, I think assist from across Using Premier League players, you know, you have to have players that can obviously, well, cross very well. But I think it's very easy if someone allows you to do that. You know, if you work with someone on doing this, I think it's pretty easy. At the same time, if you go one-on-one -on -one and you see someone's coming in from behind, make sure to cross it with X and get it in for them. I think that's the easiest way to do this, and you just have to do it in four separate matches. Um, so I think focus on this as, as a way of assisting because it is so difficult. So focus on getting this done as quickly as possible so that you can fit in within the 15 matches. I think that is the best thing to do focus on the crosses because they're going to be very very difficult but you only need one per game and then score a finesse goal using Premier League players in six separate matches um, once again I think this shouldn't be too hard if you have someone you know you keep one player that's going to be really insane for you that has a finesse shot trait um, so looking to get in players like Vardy and people like that you know and they'll be able to score those for you especially against the lower down keepers um, and I think that's going to make it so much easier for you guys in that sense um, and if we look obviously are the sort of teams uh, you should be creating, you know, 77 rating max. Guys, look, the BPL is full of players, right? You can build such great teams in the BPL. I do not, unfortunately, have a lot of fodder because of all the SBCs. I don't know how you guys are feeling, but I feel like there's too many SBCs nowadays. I just cannot simply uh, deal with, you know, I mean, the demand of having all these players. This is the best silver keeper, by the way, if you want to lower your rating. Rodak, he's an absolute beast. Anyone will tell you. Um, yeah, I just I seriously don't have enough cards. <laughs> I don't have enough cards from the Premier League. But basically, guys, you know, Simikas, another good one. Um, let's look into concept players, the players you can use uh, in this that are going to be good because of the rating. Uh, so let's have a look, you know, um, Aurea is not bad, Hector Bellerin is a good shout, he's very fast. So guys, what I would do is I would, I would try to get Hector Bellerin in there. Um, he would be one of your higher rated cards. We'll see at the end how this works out and I'll show you guys whether obviously it's worth building... Uh, this sort of a team you know in terms of defenders we're going to struggle finding someone good and lower rated because everyone that's fast is pretty much higher rated um but i think if we focus down what we have to do is we're going to have to look for players that obviously like i'd say Bai, for example uh by is a very good defender in this game but he's not very high rated we'll get him in a second um zoom is another shout Zoom is a very good shout. Lindelof is pretty quick as well in the game. Uh, funnily enough, Ake, one of the best uh, possible choices, I think. If we can get find his normal, there we go. If you have Nathan Ake in there, and then you just put Bai next to him, I think you'll be sorted in terms of pace at the back. And also, they're very low rated, so that's good for you, obviously. Right mid is going to be difficult because you obviously need a good right mid. Dan James, probably your best choice. Very fast. You know, may not be one of the best cars in the game, but at the end of the day, he is very, very fast. Um, there are two centimeters. You're obviously going to... Well, you wish you could have Ruben Neves, but you have to do this to get the Ruben Neves. Um, in terms of your centimeters, you know, Oxlade, big shout. Sizoko, very good shout. 
Uh, you'll probably need some lower rated players now. So we'll go into some silver left mids. Left mids are always easy in terms of silvers because there's a lot of pace in the Premier League. Um, generally. You know, Carlum Grant, is a, he's a good shout. I've used him before and I think he's a top, top card. I've used him in another managerial masterpiece. I, do, I don't remember which one it is. But if you guys have Che Adams, you're sorted. You know, if anyone done him, then well done. If you're not, you can buy the normal Che Adams. Um... You know, going lower down because obviously you, don't, you want to lower the rating. Enkatia is not bad. I've used him before. I've used Kamara before. He's pretty alright as well. Um, and obviously you can use, uh, where is he? There he is, Oli Burke. I've used him before as well. And he isn't bad at all. And then obviously from gold strikers, you're looking for a striker that will be able to finesse for you. Um, and look, at the end of the day, you're, you're, you're going to have to go down the ratings again, which is annoying. But, um, you know, I... I at the end of the day, you have to get something in there if you want to have the chance. Finesse shot trade. There you go. Rodrigo. Big shout. Easy to get as well. Pretty cheap. And there you go, guys. I hope you enjoyed this video, guys. And as always, make sure to click like and subscribe. The rating is 78, but it will be 77 once you put the bench on. Guys, good luck with this. Peace.